So in this video, we're gonna talk about how to further improve and enrich your editing experience in the visual view on WordPress. Um, so in order to do that, what you'll do is you'll go to plugins, add new, and you'll search for a plugin called Tiny MCE Advanced. If you're a, uh, if you're a nerd like me, um, that name will probably make a fair amount of sense, but if you're not, it maybe is a little confusing. Essentially, what that visual editor that WordPress has on it is, is a, it's powered by a thing called Tiny MCE. And so Tiny MCE Advanced is a way to improve, oh, I didn't actually click install. Um, it is a way to improve that Tiny MCE experience to get more buttons and more powers there. Um, so it's a really powerful plugin, and if you're finding yourself kind of missing features in that um, post-editing visual view, uh, Tiny MC is the thing to do. You'll notice that this looks pretty different. I now have all these file uh, commands. And there are a number of things I can do that are pretty cool. Um, just to highlight a couple, you can add tables now to your posts in Tiny MCE. So this is a table of stuff. And so that's a really powerful thing to be able to do. And there are lots of plugins that just do tables, but TinyMC Advanced does more than that. Um, for example, um, I believe somewhere in here, uh, yeah, I can find and replace. So I can actually look for the word of and change it to with. And I can actually do that inside of all my code. I see that one was found and I can hit replace all. And now that, that, became, that of became a with. Um, not super useful in this tiny table that I've made, but if you used a post and say, you know, plug in and change names and you wanted to do it or something like that, that sort of thing is really easy to do with Tiny MC Advanced. There's also some more ability to customize and do even more. Um, but the basic things are that you get this kind of almost Windows or Mac like interface of the menu right there. And then it makes it a little more intuitive to do things like insert the current time or add a table or find and replace inside of this little tiny MC window. So that's what tiny MC Advanced is for. Hope it helps you.